So this the uh, first group of guys we came up with. These are guys who are, um, you know, we're going to have contract debates about after this season. So you got to keep one, cut one, trade one with Baker, Chubb, or Ward. So our 2018 picks. Yeah. So I know I know what I'm doing. Well, why don't you tell us? So obviously you have to keep Baker because he's, if you think Baker's the guy, like I think he's the guy. You, you can't get rid of a franchise quarterback. We just saw what our franchise is like without one for the last 20 years. And then, so do you cut Chubb or do you trade him? I think you have to cut Chubb because you're going to get more for a premier corner on the open market. And so that leaves you trading Ward and then you cut Chubb. And it sucks because I'm also all in on we're going to re-sign Nick Chubb, but in this scenario, he's just the odd guy out. Yeah, that's what's that's what's interesting about this whole debate, and I'm sure we'll get a lot of – we want a lot of feedback on YouTube on how you would prioritize these players, but in this situation, you can only keep one. you got to cut one and trade one. And I don't even have to say what I'm going to do because you just said exactly what I had written out here. So yeah, cause, I, cause, I, same, same theory, same logic. Sucks, yeah. I mean, you got to keep your quarterback – Nick Chubb, you know, if you cut him right now with who we got roster, you still have Kareem Hunt. Um, and then, like you said, Denzel Ward is, I think, at least top eight corner in the league, and you're going to get something good back for him. So, uh, yeah, completely agree on that one, which yep. I hate to do with you. but I hate, yeah, I hate that too. All right, well, that one went a little bit. I was expecting <laughs> a little bit of feet, a little bit of fighting because I did Chubb's too when I wrote that. Yeah. I was like, I put the the cut next to Chubb, and I'm like, oh, I'm going to take some crap for this. But Here, as I much as it, you know, we, and we're going to talk about this um, because Josh's stance on whether we should re-sign Nick Chubb or not is awful. But uh, <laughs> you know, but it, in this scenario, I think that I mean that's what you have to do, especially if you're looking at our roster as a whole. I mean, like Zach said, we still have Kareem Hunt. I think you have to do it, but it's crazy because Nick Chubb is probably the heart of that team. I think he's yeah. probably the most well-liked and well-respected player on that team. I, I, I would agree. I would agree across with Across all 53 guys. So let us know what you guys think there. I know there's a lot of Nick Chubb lovers out there. In I'm that well, guy. Yeah, and in that, I mean, I think that it, obviously you're, who you keep is down to Baker or Nick Chubb there in that scenario of which one you want to keep and – We've seen what it was like not having a quarterback in Cleveland yeah. for so long that if you were to get rid of Baker and roll with somebody else out there, you don't even know what you're going to get. Yeah. You if know? Nick Chubb could throw the ball like Baker Mayfield, I'd say, hey, Nick Chubb, you're our <laughs> right. guy. <laughs> right. We're franchising that. <laughs> we're doing it. But no, I get it. I'm, I'm very okay with it.